What's up everybody, Kitten Roy here. So we are just less than 3 months away from the official unveiling of the Huawei's next powerhouse, the Mate 40 Pro. That means leaks will keep on coming and today is no different. The latest leak finally shows us some information regarding the processor of the Mate 40 series. So as you know that Huawei was getting its chipsets from TSMC, which is one of the biggest chip maker. They manufacture chipsets for Apple and Qualcomm. And if you don't know, TSMC recently confirmed that it has stopped taking orders from Huawei since May 15 in order to respect US ban, which is a massive loss to Huawei. But it seems Huawei found another solution for chipsets. So a well-known leakster claimed that the Mate 40 series with current processors will be exclusive to China and Huawei will follow Samsung in terms of dual chip strategy due to the ban. So if you don't know, Samsung uses two types of chipsets, one is Exynos and other one is Snapdragon. And Huawei will do the same, they have 8 million of current chipsets which they can use in the upcoming Huawei phones. And obviously 8 million is not a lot and that's why for global market, Huawei needs more chipsets and Huawei's only options are Samsung's Exynos chipsets and MediaTek processors. And chances are that it will go for the MediaTek processors. Yes, you heard me right. Meanwhile, Huawei will use customized MediaTek processors just like Sony, which looks a good deal to me since MediaTek processors are not bad at all. We have seen a lot of Oppo and Xiaomi phones running this processor and they are doing absolutely a great job. So yeah, in the upcoming Huawei phones, you will see MediaTek processors rocking. Well, BOE is one of the world's leading display maker, producing both LCDs and OLEDs. It also produces LCDs backlighting unit and solar panels. BOE has been producing small gloss based OLEDs for some time, but the company's main focus is currently in flexible and foldable OLEDs. And the best part is that, for the first time ever, BOE is supplying panels to Huawei for its upcoming Huawei's Mate 40 flagship series. They are supplying on-cell OLED panels that have the touch sensor embedded in the display itself, which is a great innovation though. So that's why the display of the Mate 40 series will be amazing, since this gives the display better optical and mechanical properties, not to mention making them thinner and cheaper. However, there are challenges that need to be solved, which is what is taking so long for display makers like BOE is to catch up. Recently, we heard that Huawei will use really thin display layer in the Mate 40 series and it seems BOE will provide the display technology. So chances are that we will see an amazing display in the Mate 40 series as well. So yeah, what do you think about this amazing deal? Do let me know your thoughts on that in the comments down below. And that's it for today's video. If you like this video, consider subscribing. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Bye. Bye.